clubs today. Go ahead. How do you plan on distinguishing yourself from uh, Warwick Davis's portrayal, which has become pretty iconic to fans? Um, he, you know, you guys just interviewed Zach, and he, he said the same thing. He probably did. He owned that character. I mean, that was him. People know it'll go to history that that. When people think of the Leprechaun movies, they think of his portrayal in it. Um, so I, it's so different, and it, and it was meant to be. I'd never seen the old movies, and I'm glad because I, I, I wouldn't have been able to take anything from those for this new character. Mm, so, have you talked to Warwick about it? No, uh, he, uh, <laughs> he was he, he kind of went off a little bit on Twitter when it was first announced that I was doing it, um, and I was gonna play her back, and but I didn't. The fan, the the fan, I mean, the Leprechaun old films have such a cult following. I mean, it's huge. Um, just the amount and, and uh, uh, of, of, of fo you know focused fans on that franchise, so big, and they were, I mean, they were pretty ticked off that it was me and not him playing it. But I think if you go into it thinking it's going to be one of, like one of the older movies, you're going to be surprised. I'm telling you, because it's nothing like it. I think it's probably about time for a fresh start on the series anyways. So gonna yeah, and, and I uh, I don't think, besides the name, there's nothing the same. I mean, after In Space yeah. and all that. Oh, you know what I mean? Man, I, I just, I haven't, like I said, series. I haven't seen him, but all I heard is Zach and I were talking to us, yeah, maybe like the, we'll do another one in space or in the hood. I go, no. Kind of makes me bad you haven't seen the other one. Two places I don't want to go in my life, the hood or in space. <laughs> 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 Not meant for those I'm places. I'm glad I didn't want you to accidentally take something from the old series into the oh, series. Oh, I hope not. Um, tell me about um, dealing with the makeup. Oh, man. That was the only hard part of that. That was more physical than anything I've done in the ring. Just strenuous, two hours a day, twice a day, and to get in, uh, and then an hour to get out every day. That was a good day. But it was... <laughs> It's all worth it. I'd sit another two hours. After how it looked and, and the character how, and how it all turned out, it, it was well worth it. Anyway. I heard there are a lot of uh, like torture chambers and, and different like things to, to pain you basically. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's very relative almost. I, I, it's to Saw, I guess. I would say Zach disagrees, but I, I relate it to that. Um, just like the little kills and all that stuff are very to me I enjoyed it because those are the horror movies I enjoy uh, I'm not a, I'm not a horror movie guy very much so doing this movie I was like oh this is so out of my realm I watch I watch comedies the same ones over and over and and, and so this is totally new for me I didn't expect it but we got some uh, we got some good kills that's for sure was it, was it intimidating being around like all that machinery that could potentially like kill you? The worst we did um, spoiler alert we did uh, we did this little like fire scene in the movie that was the scariest part of it. Like, I, was, like, I don't mess with fire. You don't know what's gonna happen. With it. You, don't, you can't predict what fire is gonna do. So I, I I didn't care for that all that much. That was we we had turned out great. How was it moving from like the more humorous character uh, Hornswoggle to playing a darker character in this film? Man, uh, when I when I first me and Zach had dinner before we started filming, about, a, about two weeks before we started the whole process, and he showed me on his iPad his his idea for this character and the look and everything, and I was like, really? Is that what you thinking? Like not just like surprised at how different I was expecting. Green suit, green pants, stupid little hat, <laughs> like what I wear on TV. Um, but it, it was, it was a, 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 a fresh, you know, a fresh t three weeks of filming, because I didn't have to be this jovial thing that I, that I play every day of the year. I was this dark, you know, kind of demented character. And it was great. It was, it was a real cool experience to go from this happy-go-lucky hornswoggle to this. It was, it was fun. Do you think that's common in general, that, that uh, you know, concern about being typecast, that those are the only ones available to you, or that you have to go that way, or do you have plans to expand beyond that? You know what, I, uh, after doing this, I would love for it to open doors into other films, you know, and, and, and the movie realm, and like you said, I, I you know, 
midgets are always going to be typecast as, you know, happy-go-lucky kind of jokester characters in movies and film. And it's it's one of those things where I, I, there has to be one film in the future that has a person of my stature as, like, a lead role. It hasn't happened yet, but it's just, it has to happen at some point. And to be taken seriously, you know, otherwise people of my stature will never be taken seriously in movies. So it needs to happen at some point. Hopefully this is it. Uh, this is definitely going to be taken seriously, that's yeah, for sure. Yeah. But, uh, Do you think that uh, maybe if this is a huge success, you might be able to bring this kind of character into the ring with you? I hope not. <laughs> yeah. I hope but I he is hoping to, for sequels. To, to, have to, to have to wrestle in, in, in yeah, all the stuff I was wearing, that'd be tougher than wrestling. More, more like the persona, like the darker... I would love that. Like I would love, yeah. That would be that would be great. It would be a, it would be a fresh change, too. Did you Good. have to... Um, did you have to brush up on your Irish accent, or was it okay working with guys like Finley and Seamus and stuff like that? I have. I, I'm the worst at accents, so <laughs> I uh, I can't I can't reveal if and what my lines were. Gotcha. But uh, it was Irish accent didn't help. <laughs>